Welcome. In this tutorial, you'll learn how ChatGPT can generate Kahoot questions and format them to import into Kahoot. I recommend you watch this video all the way through the first time and then work along with the video the second time. It's best to make the Kahoot in stages and check ChatGPT's work at each step. I'm starting with a list of vocabulary words. If you have a lecture or book chapter, it's probably best to have ChatGPT summarize it into key points or vocabulary before you turn it into a Kahoot. Alternatively, you can ask ChatGPT to write questions about a topic. I have 10 cybersecurity vocab words. If you have more than 15, it's probably best to break them down into smaller chunks. You can find my prompt in the video description. ChatGPT has generated some questions. I'm going to look through them to make sure there aren't any obvious problems. If a question looks over 120 characters or an answer over 75 characters, I'll copy and paste it into this web page to do a character count. There's a link to this site in the description. If there is an issue with the output, there are three things you can do. First, you can press the Regenerate button, which will sometimes fix it. Second, you can tell ChatGPT what to correct. Finally, you can scroll up and edit the original prompt. You can try being more specific, though sometimes editing it and resubmitting with no changes will cause it to do it correctly the second time. Next, I'm going to instruct ChatGPT to format the questions as a table that I can paste into a Kahoot Excel template. You can find this prompt in the description. Looking at the table, ChatGPT cut off the questions with an ellipsis. I'm going to scroll back up and edit the prompt. I make no changes and hit submit. This time it comes out correct. Now I'm going to copy the table. Make sure to start selecting at the second row because the first row contains the column headers. With the table selected, press Ctrl-C on Windows or Command-C on a Mac. Next, log into Kahoot and create a new lesson. Click on Add Question and then select Import Spreadsheet. Click Download Our Template. Give the spreadsheet a descriptive name and save it in a folder. Once downloaded, open the file in Excel or your preferred spreadsheet software. Click on the cell at Row 1, Column B. To paste, press Ctrl V on Windows or Command V on a Mac. If you want to go back to ChatGPT and generate another set of questions, you can paste them underneath these in the same Excel file. Save the Excel document and close it. Back to Kahoot, click on Select File. Navigate to the file and select it. Click Add Questions. Check out the problems and make sure they look good. The time limit may be set unrealistically, so adjust as necessary. Scroll up to the first problem which was generated when you created the Kahoot and delete it. Finally, save the Kahoot, add a title, and you're ready to go. If you have any questions about ChatGPT and education, or topic ideas for future videos, please tell me in the comments. To keep learning, check out the next video, and I'll see you soon.